everyone, welcome back or welcome if you are new. My name is Tanya with Mind, Body, and Soul Company and I make aromatherapy, bath, and beauty products. So for today's soap, we are doing a confetti soap. So I'm just gonna get started by pouring my lye water into my oils here. There is sodium lactate in the lye water and there is kaolin clay in the oils. And then I'm just gonna give that a quick blend. So what I'm going to do next is I'm just going to pour off some of the batter into this container here. This confetti soap is going to be a layered soap as well as I'm using some of the batter for a column mold for another project. So I'm going to go ahead and get this one mixed up first. I'm going to use Magenta Mica from Brambleberry. And then I'm just going to stir it in before I blend it. I'm not going to add the fragrance oil to this part yet, or actually it's an essential oil blend, not fragrance oil. Um, because I don't want the column mold scented. Okay, now I'm going to give this a quick blend. Okay, now into this container, I'm gonna add in half of my essential oil blend. This is Ylang Ylang, Geranium, and Lavender. And then give that a quick stir. Smells really nice and fresh. The geranium is pretty a pretty potent smell, I think. A nice floral, but still pretty strong. So that you really pick that up. Okay. And I'm gonna bring over my mold and we're gonna do a layer of this magenta on the bottom. That looks good there. So I'm going to set that to the side. And then in this container, I'm going to add in titanium dioxide as well as the rest of my essential oil blend. And give that a stir to start with. Now I'm going to blend this up. And now I'm 
gonna add in my soap shavings. Stir those all in. That looks good. Now I am sure I will have extra here and I'll just put those in another, any extra I have in another little mold uh, for samples. I might not have too much extra since I did that column. Might end up being just right. Wouldn't that be perfect? Now I'm gonna scrape the rest of my magenta on the top. I'm kinda just gonna plop that down the middle. some silver hollow from nurture oh that came out really really quick <laughs> it's gonna have a real glittery top on this one i'm just gonna spritz it with some rubbing alcohol and then i'll bring it in for a close-up So we are back to cut my confetti soap. Really pleased with how it turned out. You can still really pick up the geranium and the ylang ylang in it. And it's a pretty uh, nice light white or cream there. So the shreds really pop. I love that layer of pink on the bottom. There's the top. to put like a piece of uh, that non-skid shelf liner under my cutter. I always seem to move it around. And here is this one. So today is Christmas Eve when I am filming this. So hoping that everyone has a great Christmas and that you get the chance to celebrate a little bit. Um, even if things are a little different this year, there uh, is still, you know, still something to celebrate. We all made it through the year, so that's something. We are just going to kind of hang out and play games and not do much of anything this year. That one's really pretty. So this soap, as I had said, is made with an essential oil blend. I am planning to transition to using only essential oils. I think that's gonna take me about a year to do though, based on the number of fragrance oils I still have. But that is the current plan. And I hope that you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and I will catch you in my next one.